Good morning. Um, this is Sarah for no matter whatever. Um, I'm actually, um, I was a grown up yesterday and I went and got my sink fixed. I feel a lot better, but, um, I drove from Vancouver to Portland to work. And so I, um, somehow I made it here early in Esther. I think everyone was just afraid to be by me. So they mostly passed me and stayed out of my way. So, um, yeah, so I have an extra, I don't know, half an hour, so it was kind of cool. I made some tea, and I filled up on propane, so, like, it's, like, super toasty hot in here, even though it's super cold outside, and, um, yeah, it's all cozy in here, and I'll show you the, the sink stuff. All right, here is, um, my new sink, a couple dishes, a sponge, but, um, same exact thing, just swivel hot and cold there's no longer a leak everything's new um this was my old one as you can see they're pretty identical um which um not bad at all it was a 1995 for a new sink and um i tried messing with it myself i couldn't and uh my uncle bob actually I took it over there and after lots of son of a bitch or motherfucker and um such she um totally got it fixed there is a little water damage to the um ply board what's that shitty board called i don't know i'm not really too interested in what it's called anyway but i have my actually i should do that oh sorry there's my hand um i've been keeping my heat on in the in the cabinet open Maybe it'll dry it a little. It's not a super bad water damage. Nothing I have to take care of right at this moment. But um, yeah, I got my sink fixed and filled up on propane. And um, I don't know. He, we were going through the manual, and I guess it says that. I guess I always thought I did have one tank, but I guess that's true. But it might be divided into gray and black. Um, I don't know. I didn't get one full manual on this RV. I got a bunch of mini sheets of paper kind of scattered. So. I don't know. It was kind of fun to get through that, but, um, so I'm going to kind of talk to my uncle and he seems to know tons about this stuff. So I will get a little more educated on Esther and take a look at those. Um, it's going I got the sink fixed. It's just like, it's cozy again. It's nice. Like it's clean and I have running water and heat and I don't know. You take, what's that car doing? You take that for granted when you uh, have it. And then when you don't have it, you're like, oh man. I was spoiled for so long. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep this short and sweet, I think. That's all. I don't know. You've, you can sit. Oh, there's actually the maintenance guy for our work who does all of the fixes to the machines inside, and he's watching me make a YouTube video. He probably thinks I'm a weirdo. Good morning. No tea for you. Um, actually, I have plenty of tea. I could offer him some, but... Yeah, let's see. Uh, ooh, there's a new addition. Remember Rocky, right? Rocky Raccoon. He's wild and crazy, cute and fun. Um, he's kind of my um, RV buddy, but he has a friend now. Where is he? Ooh, hold on. I got to do some climbing. Un momento. This is his friend Meatball. Man, um, he's a bulldog and she rides a skateboard. She's got a sweet cap. And uh, he's got a clock on his neck because he's like, Flavor Flav. Yeah, boy. Yep, that's about it. Um, life's good. Put my laundry away in my lunch break. Have some grub. I should probably go clock in to real life and go to work. But, um, yeah, so sink's fixed. Heater's going. It's all working good now. Um, yeah, Esther's in pretty good shape. I do, I guess I have a brake light out. I didn't know my baby bro, or by baby bro, I mean, what, I'm 29, so he's 19. He's still a baby to me. I used to wipe his butt, so he's a baby to me. But, uh, he got his first own place. It was pretty cute, but we all went and had a pizza at my aunt and uncle's house, and uh, he was tailing me, and he's like, you know your brake light's out, right? And I'm like, shut up. But, um, it was cool. He just tailed me there and back so no one could pull me over because he was behind me. But, uh, I hope everyone's good, and um, I will talk to you guys all soon when I got something to say, 
And yeah, take it sleazy. This is Sarah for No Matter Whatever. See ya.